debt collector or scam artist, we're helping you keep your money in your pocket. Two ways you can spot a bogus bill collector. Plus a roller coaster ride of rain chances this week. I'll show you which day will be the wettest. Before you walk out the door, I'll show you how to avoid accidents. Tomorrow, we're comparing the top video streaming services and the cool features that come with them. Plus, it's double the fun at 6 a.m., your chance to win four tickets to see Luke Bryan's concert in South Haven. And temperatures are heating up across the Mid-South. I'll show you what areas could hit 90 degrees. Taking the stress out of car shopping. Tomorrow, the five things to do before you go. Plus, more rain this week across the Mid-South. I'll show you when you will need the umbrella. And after the holiday, rush hour traffic is getting back to normal. I'll keep an eye on the hot spots tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, the new plan to fix the crime on Beale Street. I'll bring you breaking developments in the Alert Center. Plus, the heat is cranking up across the Mid-South. I'll show you which day will be the hottest. A battle in the kitchen, the pros and cons of gas or electric heat tomorrow morning. Friday, it heats up across the Mid-South. We'll show you how high temperatures will go. Plus, salon perfect nails at home in just seconds. We're putting this new tool to the test. And killed in the line of duty, the Mid-South comes together to say goodbye to fallen MPD officer Riddell Smith tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, more dangerous heat. I'll show you how high the heat index will go. Summer shape up the healthy foods that are keeping you from your weight loss goals and why. And we're rolling into the midweek. I'll keep an eye on your commute tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, credit score help. The three things you can do to improve your numbers in three months. Plus, the summer sizzle continues. I'll show you when it could feel like triple digits. I'm tracking your Wednesday morning commute because you're never more than seven minutes away from first alert weather and traffic. Breaking at five, a man shot outside of Burger King, who police are looking for right now. Plus, a trusted family friend turned accused child rapist, the way the sinister secret was revealed, and how a Memphis waitress's lawsuit over tips could change the service industry at five. Severe weather alert. We're tracking heavy rain and flooding and more dangerous weather ahead. Plus, the knock at the door and answer that nearly cost a Memphis woman her life. Broke the window, crawled through the window. The fiery rescue that has some calling this man a hero at five. Breaking at 5, a suicide turned homicide investigation. What we've learned about the death of a Shelby County inmate. Plus, when you'll see new body cameras hitting Memphis streets. Also, cars torched, and it was no accident. The incredible surveillance video at 5. Everybody on the street was in danger. At 5, meth lab materials discovered in a Mid-South neighborhood. The clues that led police straight to this home. Plus, a two-year-old wanders away from home alone. How a quick-thinking neighbor helped the child get back to his family at 5. At 5, Memphis under siege, the mayor in the hot seat. His response to the constant chaos and terror, plus running from bullets downtown. Just really thinking I could die right now. The one thing that may have saved his life and this accused cop killer's troubled past. At 5. Tonight at 10, parents don't miss the new and alarming way some University of Memphis students are getting around campus that could put them on the fast track to danger. And the heartwarming way a Memphis police officer saved one child's Easter celebration at 10. Oh, it was a shock. You know, we can't get home. Breaking at 10 in 10 hours of this frantic standoff. Now over two men dead, one MPD officer down. Team coverage on the officer's condition and what led up to the violence that had children running for their lives. If we had a, a K-9 Hall of Fame, Garner would be in it. And a tearful goodbye. The reason this canine was so much more than a dog at 10. Decided to take what wasn't theirs. At 10, caught on camera, bold crooks on the prowl. How this break-in is similar to other crimes in Memphis. Plus, why Jessica Chambers' family is closer than ever to getting justice. And he did not deserve to get shot down. A family's grief magnified. Their loved one's murder posted online. Their message to the accused gunman who took a life at 10. Several stories breaking now. At 10, another profound music legend gone. The legacy of Elvis guitarist Scotty Moore that changed American music history. Also breaking, a man dead after a bulldozer flips over the drastic efforts to try to save him. At She's my only daughter. A mom of three gunned down while just sitting in a car, but it's the mystery behind her death it's adding more pain for her family next to 10. And so then when he grabbed hold to my thigh, and we're like, you gonna come here? At 10, downtown attack in broad daylight. The saving grace that helped one woman escape, plus. It sounds like he hit, uh, you know, at least a couple dozen cars. 
This crook known as the Mushroom Man could be out for your ride. The sneaky scheme he's allegedly using to cover his tracks next at 10. Breaking at 10, why one Tennessee lawmaker suggested allowing ISIS to recruit at your kid's college. Plus, a woman flashed in Germantown. Find out the creepy move that happened before the act. Next at 10. Breaking at 10, what we've uncovered about the victim killed in this road rage shooting. Heavy rain and thunderstorms bring the possibility of flash flooding to many. I'll tell you what to expect where you are. And radio host Michael Adrian Davis's shocking announcement at 10. Traffic is being rerouted off of Interstate 40 after police respond to a pedestrian being hit. Find out the latest information coming up. Plus, ladies, don't miss the popular styles that could cause hair loss. Tonight at 10. Teens murdered at an alarming rate, including this 16-year-old. What police say will help curb the violent crime. And get ready to never see sales the same again. Walmart's undercover deals that will have you ditching the clearance racks at 10. We live in a fast-paced world, and things can change in a minute. That's why we have the Alert Center, breaking news from across the street or across the world, knowing what's happening in your world. That's how we help you start your day. WMC Action News 5. Construction, crashes, I see it all. I'm a native Memphian. I know the back roads and alternate routes to help you avoid the mess. Getting to work without being stuck in a traffic jam. That's how we help you start your day. WMC Action News 5. Mornings are hectic. Let us help you get ready. Breaking news, news from overnight, and weather and traffic never more than seven minutes away. Keeping you informed. That's how we help you start your day. WMC Action News 5. Rise and shine. The day may be new to you, but the news has been happening all night long. Catch up on what's happening in your neighborhood, the city, the country. That's how we help you start your day. WMC Action News 5 the first thing you want to know when you wake up. How's the weather? That's why we have your first alert hour by hour forecast and weather is never more than seven minutes away. Knowing if you need that jacket or umbrella. That's how we help you start your day. WMC Action News 5. First alert storm track Doppler 5. Now with the power of the Doppler network and dual pole technology. Five times the power, street level precision, enhanced views inside the storm, 3D imaging, western most location. What does all this mean for you? We have the experience and technology to keep you safe. First alert storm track Doppler 5, only on WMC Action News 5. Five minutes. It might not seem like a lot of time, but when every second counts, it makes all the difference. First Solar Doppler 5 tracks weather in real time, no delays, up to five minutes ahead of other stations. In five minutes, you can cook an egg, take a shower, and in those same minutes, a tornado can destroy your neighborhood. So we give you those extra minutes to get ready. The WMC Action News 5 First Alert weather team, working for you every minute of every day. Breaking news alert. You can see firefighters are on the scene. When news breaks, we're your first alert. Still a very active scene out here. Anywhere. Live in Collierville. Live in Raleigh. Any hour. Around 4 o'clock when we arrived here on... Any day. My video you're not going to see anywhere else. On the street. We have team coverage. In the air. Chopper 5. You can see the... On your phone. Whenever news breaks. Making a beeline towards the Mid-South. Wherever news breaks. Found in Tipton County. Count on WMC Action News 5. Your first alert for breaking news. Free money. Nope. No strings attached, right? Afraid not. It happened to this woman. Her money gone. How to protect your money from scammers at five. Over 25 million scammed in the last year, and it can easily happen to you. I'm not giving you my social security number. You the IRS. Protect yourself. Tools you can use to track the schemes right down to your own neighborhood. Today at five. Buckled up, Wait. strapped in. Whoa. Now imagine going 30 to 40 miles Ooh, an hour. That's frightening. Without a seatbelt. Crash test every driver should see. It could save your life at five. A big business. Bundle hair is the biggest trend out right now. Getting big money. And you just spent how much? $240. 240 dollars And sometimes it comes with an even bigger risk. Whenever there's money being made, the wolves will show up. Tonight at 10, hair heists in Memphis have become more frequent and deadly.
They going crazy over her. Jerrica Phillips investigates how hair stores are taking precautions to protect themselves and you from hair heist. Tonight on WMC Action News 5 at 10. You know you locked your car, but someone got in and stole your stuff. No key, no broken glass, and your car is still locked. How did they do it? Clearly not a Slim Jim or something that you would normally think. Tonight at 10, Andy Wise reveals the high-tech gadgets thieves use to break into your car in just a matter of seconds. I can get in your car anytime. Three ways to keep the crooks out and how to stop them from stealing. Your name, your address. I'm going to get all that information. Tonight on WMC Action News 5 at 10. If evil enters the room. Woo, woo, woo. So you have an active shooter in the building. What would you do? <laughs> at school, hey, the movies, no, or no. at work. He's got a gun! He's got a gun! Woo. Woo. What would you do? Three ways to survive any situation. And tonight at 10, Andy Wise shows you how. We can give you a fighting chance. Because your life and the others around you may depend on it tonight on WMC Action News 5 at 10. Do you shop at Family Dollar? He said, don't move or, uh, or I'm gonna hurt you. Dollar General. Three guys coming out with guns. Wednesday on WMC Action News 5 at 10. Two discount chains. More than 6,000 incidents in just 16 months. That's more than 12 police visits a day. Every day you walk in there, you do your life. We reveal the locations targeted the most. And what, if anything, is being done? Man, somebody's gonna be killed there. Wednesday on WMC Action News 5 at 10. So what do you do? Thursday at 10, getting help quickly in a dangerous situation could be just a security app away. I never thought about that until now. I probably should. We'll reveal how these apps work. Alarm activated. The best ways to use them. This is an official warning. And why they're being called the next generation and protection. Thursday on WMC Action News 5 at 10. WMC Action News 5, undercover investigation. I got this computer won't boot up. A repairman says something is definitely wrong. I can't find the hard drive. But can you trust them to fix it? Monday at 10, we conduct a hidden camera experiment. The operating system needs to be reinstalled. Putting three different Mid-South computer repair shops to the test. You're looking to go to 100, a little over 100 for the repair. Who passed? Who failed? And why? Monday on WMC Action News 5 at 10.